What's up, guys? I got some uh, music on. Hope you guys like it while I do my lacrosse video. Hope it's not too loud. I can turn it down a little bit. Alright, there you go. Um, today I got an Evo 2.0. Strung myself with 9 Diamond. I did just a standard top lace instead of a... Uh, Here, I'll just mute that for now. That's kind of getting annoying. That's a bad idea putting that on. Um, but, okay, yeah, my Evo. I just got nine diamond standard top lace, which means that instead of going in two holes, I only go through one, 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 and one. Uh, it's not as good as I wanted it to turn out like the top lace, because my top lace, I like it to look equally distributed like that. I like it to look like a V, like an upside down V like that, but I got weird ones like this one and this one and this one. They're kind of like just straight up and down two lines, but um, I could really care less. Uh, I played on my um, <clears throat> high school lacrosse team this year, and I picked up this pocket from one of my teammates he does this cool little like weird knot uh doesn't really have a name yet i don't think i i have the liberty to naming it because i didn't come up with it but this is how he usually strings his sticks but with 10 diamond and i kind of tweaked it a little bit um usually he has just one nylon instead of a braid nylon and it's a u a four u a straight and a nylon all right next to each other but I traded him this is the head I traded him uh, this was his head but I uh, kinda tweaked it a little bit instead of having everything next to each other I moved everything I, I mean I just moved the nylon up and I put a braided nylon in instead and down at the bottom I did this cool little design it's two separate strings one's a cross and one is a just a regular loop and as for a pocket, it's not much of a defined pocket. It's kind of like it like ramps down, and then it's like a big pocket right here. Um, <clears throat> has the channel? Not really a good channel, but it has a ton of hold. There's a lot, a lot of hold. Um, so how to string this? If you have an Evo 2.0, I would hi and you're like an intermediate or advanced player, I would highly recommend how I strung this. So what you do, no matter if it's 10 diamond or 9 diamond, it doesn't matter. You go through uh, for the first hole and you string the top. Then you go into the second hole, tie like that. And then what you want to do is right here, go into the first mesh hole, into the second um uh, sidewall piece hole right here go back through the first piece of mesh go all the way down here don't go through that piece of mesh yet do a regular um like how you would usually do like a single but instead of going through the mesh hole first go straight from uh, the first mesh hole down to the sidewall piece and then attach the mesh on by like looping it up and pulling it down um it's kind of hard to explain. I'll be uploading another one tonight. I just got a brand new white M80, Warrior M80. <clears throat> and I'm going to try to string that up later, so I'm going to show you what I mean. But just, it, it's basically an interlock. So, it's kind of like a looser interlock. So, we'll just say that for now. So, you're going to go first hole, string the top. Go second hole in. Um, put your knot in, thread it go through the first hole into the third met or head hole go back through the first piece of mesh go down do a loose interlock and then the second one I'm going to show you what I mean by these weird knots it's like it's not interlock or love knot here's a really good example this last knot that you do here um it's like you go <clears throat> you basically interlock without like the mesh piece like go down and do a full interlock without attaching a piece of mesh and then go 
Let's see how I did it. You go up, like away from the head, through the mesh hole coming towards me, and then under the interlock, and then like keep going. It's hard to do while I'm just like talking about it here, but I'll show. I'll be showing you later with my M80. Um, this head is awesome. It's an Evo 2.0, not an Evo or an Evo Pro. Um. I think I've had an Evo and an Evo Pro, and personally, I think that the Evo 2.0 is the better one of the Evos. I've also had an Evo 3X. Those are kind of cool, but they're a little too wide for me. So, um, I traded my Evo away for an orange clutch, and then the kid who had this head um, gave one of these to me, strung plus a Nike Vandal, plus a, a white M80, which I'll be using later. It's like brand new. It is brand new. He just never used it for just for my clutch head. And it was strung really badly. It was that factory strung. So I think it was a bad deal on his part. I think I kind of hustled him, but I don't really care because this head's awesome and I'm going to be stringing the M80 the exact same way, except I'll be using a white top two green uh, sidewall strings down the bottom a uh, white shooting string in here for the bottom all white shooting strings here and white mesh so it won't look too bad but um yeah that's really it I think it's a good pocket uh, I'll show you how much hold it has with a ball later it's like it's 330 right now 330 almost 340 actually um, not that it matters, but maybe around like 5.30, o'clock-ish, um, I'll make the M80 video, if I can find all my strings that I had. Um, so, yeah, there's my Evo 2.0. I'll see you later.